हेलो माई लिप्स वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल दिस मृदुला भास्कर एंड आई नो द वीडियो मैंशन दैट वी आर गोइंग टू हैव अ मेकअप लुक एंड अ लुक बुक फॉर वैलेंटाइंस डे एंड हियर आई एम स्टैंडिंग इन माई पैजामाज विथ अंडन नेल्स एंड एवरीथिंग सो वी आर गोइंग टू मेक इट लाइक अ व्लॉग अलॉन्ग विद स्टूडियो सेट अप मेकअप सो दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू हैव इट ऑल लेट्स जम्प इट द वीडियो बट बिफोर जम्पिंग द वीडियो डोंट फर गेट हिट दैट सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड हिट द नोटिफिकेशन बेल सो दैट यूल बी नोटिफाइड वेन एवर आई पोस्ट अडियो so first my nails it's so terrible it's worn out so i'm just going to remove my nail polish first because half the time i wear nail polish and then i end up um looking like this it's very very bad you guys i usually use the color bar nail polish remover but today this is the only thing i could done so this is from lakme the nail color remover so i'm just using that uh with cotton buds from mini so to take off my nail polish Oh yes my nail polish is off and uh, I feel so much lighter by heart now so I'll quickly do my skincare now before we move into the studio setup so first I'm going to be using the advanced nail 96 mucin power essence from Cosrx okay this is like slimy <laughs> it's really really slimy can you see that <laughs> that's how slimy it is but it feels nearly nice and moisturizing on the skin more like a serum and uh, it is really help me calm my skin out to a large large extent okay so i have a mirror and the viewfinder here okay so i'm going to be looking into that over that i'm going to be using the simple light moisturizer and the very important thing because the sun is showing himself a lot to us these days the minimalist sunscreen okay this is the multi mineral uh, no multi vitamin sunscreen spf 50 broad spectrum pa plus 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 okay very nice sunscreen and uh, gives very good protection don't get worried by the white cast it vanishes <laughs> pretty quickly okay so i'm just going to let that soak into my skin and i will do the camera setup for my studio and i will meet you all to do the makeup there so we are here in the studio setup and i think it's slightly better than doing it over there and i have a lot of background noise today is the day i decided to shoot this video and there's noise every damn place and i don't know what to do about it but anyways let's get into the video now first i have uh, done my skin care like you all saw we're going to go in with a primer my skin is acting up a little oily so i'm using the blue heaven oil free flawless uh makeup primer okay this is nice silicone based primer it doesn't clog the pores very lightweight it helps the makeup slip on nicely so i'm just going to apply that and let it sit especially when you are applying a primer make sure you know sort of go wherever you have the lines okay under your eyes okay and then in your laugh line areas and everywhere so you don't want to look like you know you have applied a too much of makeup in a way that crease you want to avoid creases in every possible way especially when you're getting ready to go out uh, maybe for a dinner or something obviously someone's going to be seeing you up close and personal and you don't want to be creasing up Next I'm going to be using the Swiss Beauty eyebrow palette okay very nice palette I've kept speaking about it in all my videos so I think you'll know everything about this particular palette but anyway I will repeat it three eyebrow shades and one wax a gray a black and a brown so very nice palette love it Okay so I've gone along the shape of my brows only I'll do the other brow off camera and get right back Okay so I've done my brows off camera and I've just filled into the sparse areas I think yeah that's about it I have not done anything much 
So now for covering all the dark spots and pigmentation, I'm not going to be applying a foundation all over my face, just in those spots where I need coverage and that's about it. So for the foundation, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Superstay 24 hour foundation. I'm picking up a very little product in the back of my hand and just applying it wherever I need coverage, okay? Very little product. I've taken half a pump over here, okay? Nothing much. I'm just applying it first and then just blending it out ever so lightly. So next we are going to go in with a lip and cheek tint from Eba Cosmetics, okay? This is in the shade All Time Pink. I've taken the product on a fluffy brush, okay, and I'm just patting it. It might feel a little too much now or a little too pink now. It's okay, we're going to use more products, so it'll definitely fall in its place. So just to get a feel of this look, I'm applying the same product on my lips as well. I'm using the same product and just going over my eyes, okay? Just spreading it all over my lid, not too much, but very, very little. Now I'm just taking a kajal, this is from Mars Cosmetics, okay? I'm just gonna use it. Whenever I use kajal, I go full on, okay? I don't hold back from using a kajal. Oh God, I got it on my lid as well. Now since I got kajal on my lid, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw one small line over here, okay? I'm picking a black eyeshadow, any eyeshadow you want, okay? I had this Swiss Beauty Infinite palette in front of me, so I'm just picking the black shadow on that and just blending out the kajal, okay? Can you see? I'm not keeping it in a way that it becomes too black, okay? That's about it. I don't want to do anything more than this. So I'm taking a flat top kabuki brush from the Do Care kit, okay? I put up a video about uh, this particular brush kit. I'll link it up here but you can definitely check that video out very nice brush i'm just patting in a way that all the creases are removed i'm going to be using the mask compact powder okay so this particular powder has two shades okay one is light and an other one is a little dark okay wait i got that wrong where am i this is the other shade yeah here so this is the lighter shade and this is the darker shade so you can use it to highlight under your eyes and apply powder all over your face so i'm going to be using this product so I'm first picking the lighter shade and going under my eyes, okay? How that instantly brightens the face, I am so in love. So I'm applying the same black in a very thin way under my eye, okay? So I decided to not go in with false lashes, okay? I am pretty uncomfortable in false lashes. If you're comfortable with false lashes, go for it, no worries at all. But sometimes when, you know, you're going out or anything, if it's windy or anything, the glue might wear off or your eyes are watering, you know, I like to avoid such problems. So I'm going to be using a lash primer and a mascara. It will give more or less the same effect. You're going to watch it now. Can you see the difference already just with a lash primer? Okay, so I've applied a lash primer, okay? This is from Brash Fair Beauty. You would have already seen it in the description over here. I will leave that for about 10 minutes and I will complete the rest of my face. So for the lip, I feel it's a little too pink because I have chosen a mauve dress, okay? I want to top it off with a non-transfer lipstick from Mars, okay? When they say this is non-transfer, this is actually non-transfer, you guys. This is in the shade First Date. So I think that lipstick sort of tied the look together. It toned down that whole feeling of having too much on the lip. So the lash primer has dried out, okay? Now I'm going to apply a mascara again from Mars. One of my favorite mascaras now. Can you see the difference between both my eyes? Wait, you gotta see it. I'm gonna come close to the camera. Can you see? Can you see the difference? I certainly can. Okay, I'm gonna be using the Swiss Beauty Makeup Fixer. This is a little too much of fragrance for me to put directly on my face. So what I'll do is put it on a beauty sponge. So I'm just dabbing it all over my face. It sort of 
presses in all the powder, locks in the makeup and of course the intensity of your makeup doesn't go for a toss with this particular um, you know technique. So yes my loves, the makeup is done. I'm going to be changing my dress, accessorizing and I'll get right back. Yes, my loves, we come to the end of today's video. This video was in partnership with Amazon. From the dress to the earrings to the clip, the jewelry that I'm wearing in my hand to the bag to every makeup product that I used was picked up on Amazon. And you can definitely shop all the products that I used on great, great offers. And even the delivery is super quick, you guys. I planned this video just a couple of days before making the video and I had all the stuff at my doorstep in just two days. I hope you all liked today's video and had fun as much as I had fun making this video for all of you. If you by any chance use this makeup look on yourself, don't forget to tag me. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I post a video. Have a good Valentine's Day and I wish you a life full of love. Take care my loves. Bye-bye.